The Wellsville School System is getting a lot of money each year from a partnership with an energy company. First News reporter Jacob Thompson spoke to the superintendent and learned how the district has spent the money so far. If you live in the village of Wellsville and attended some football games, you may have noticed a new look. Turf for the fields and the blacktop that surrounds the field, something that was made possible by a partnership. Well, we were contacted about four years ago by Advanced Power, which became Southfield Energy, talking about the possibility of putting in a gas-fired uh, electric plant in our area. I'm told that Southfield Energy is receiving a tax break from the district. In return, the school receives $1.7 million during the construction phase of South Energy Plant. Afterwards, the school will receive $1.5 million a year for the next 15 years. But I'm told the new field wasn't even towards the top of the to-do list. First was infrastructure. We put a whole new heating and cooling system in Garfield Elementary. We also went and we re put air conditioning in Daw Elementary. We just put in a new boiler system here. They also hired a new high school math teacher, brought back elementary art and music teachers, and are in the process of hiring a full-time mental health expert, another step to protecting the children. We're probably one of the only school systems in Columbiana County that has a resource officer in every building. So we've taken a whole new approach to, you know, safety of our children. So we took care of things for kids before we considered the track and field. As of right now, the next project is still undecided, but the school is re-examining their needs at this point. In Wellsville, Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News.